little night out with the wifeies, huh, fellas? That's what's going on. You're a big fucking Mexican, bro. <laughs> bro, fucking stocky, dude. You're ready to go. You look like a tan Andy Ruiz, man. <laughs> Fat Mexicans got confidence now, bro. Don't fuck with that. <laughs> Did that mean a lot to you when Andy Ruiz won? Did it mean a lot? Was it like a powerful moment for you as a Mexican? I can't hear you, bro. I have that hearing. <laughs> I hate to break it to you, dog, but I'm amplified. You said you might be deaf, homie. That shit, you ain't got bad here. This a rap for you. <laughs> I like how you got the hair pulled back and everything. You're like, nothing in front of my ears, dog. I mean, nothing. Now you understand everything. I don't know what's happening. I think you're just playing a trick. You out with the wife and you've been telling her you're dead for the last five years. <laughs> this guy's committed to his lies. I respect that shit. Babe, I tried to listen. I really did. I couldn't have nothing out there. It was just like when you're telling me your stories about work. It's so hard for me to hear it. Are you guys friends or girlfriend, girlfriend? What are you guys? You're just friends? You never hook up at all? <laughs> <laughs> You've never done anything. You never. <laughs> now what? We're in the show me stage. Show me that dyke shit. <laughs> <laughs> You got bi curious glasses. <laughs> no, you're a hot, you're a hot lesbian. Give me the glasses, yo. Oh shit, you could make out here making guys feel good about themselves, huh? <laughs> Bro, when she grabbed it, it looked like she was holding a baguette. <laughs> <laughs> the Louisville slugger right here. <laughs> <laughs> You've heard that before, right? <laughs> guys just looked up. You're the only girl I'd be like, just jerk it. <laughs> <laughs> I want to feel like a man. Don't look at her. Look at me. I'm talking to you. Okay? I can see who the top lesbian is in this relationship. <laughs> May I speak? May, may I respond to the question? Will I get my pussy ate later if I respond to this one? You are tough, huh? You lay them little hands down like this. You ever been backhanded by the Burger King hand? <laughs> the Whopper Junior hand? <laughs> you know her from school? Okay, okay, that's what's up. What's your name? Janara. And you? Yo, black people, step it up, yo. Step it up. Step it up. Step First of all, you need to give that so damn black shirt to that woman right there, okay? Because your shirt don't make sense for you. Janana? Janana? That's a white woman named Janana. Black people that are a little bit older, have you ever heard of a white person named Janana? I feel like that's the second singer in every black band in history. It's Teddy's number one and then Janana. Bro, what is happening right now? What's your name? Volgana? Yo, Game of Thrones is over, white people. Y'all need to really just relax, give it up. It ain't coming back. Janana. What is your name? Volgana. That's how you say pussy and lesbian. <laughs> you know, lesbians got their own language, right? You just got to get back to Volgana this night. Yo, what, what are they saying, man? I don't understand. What? Say it. Vil Donna. So Will Donna. But with a W, it's with the V. Did you just show me what a V looked like? Listen, listen, girl. If there's one thing I know that you know what it looks like, it's a V. Put out that big open pussy with that. <laughs> you almost took a lick too. You're like, it's a, it's a V. It's a V. 
What's wrong with you? <laughs> Vildana and Jadana. Jadana. What's your last name? Oh, you guys are Russian. Polish. Bosnian. That's just South Russia. Right? It's just the scary whites. <laughs> They're scary whites. Don't fuck with these whites, guys. You can fuck with like English whites, don't fuck with them. These, these are motherfuckers that's chasing around Liam Neeson in the Taken movies. It's been three movies. It's like, yo, get over it. He was your cousin, bro. It's not even, you killed my second cousin twice removed. <laughs> I will exact vengeance on you for killing my second cousin twice removed. Were you born in Bosnia, right? What is it like to feel like free to be gay? <laughs> you don't gotta hide in like the barracks of the castle anymore. I don't know what shit looks like in Bosnia, but I imagine it's a lot like King's Landing. Don't they film it over there? How, how far is Croatia from there? It's right next to it. Oh, that's right, you guys got all this beef, but you're the same. <laughs> right, it's Bosnia, Serbia, Herzegovina, <laughs> Montenegro. I don't even feel comfortable saying that one. <laughs> right, Montenegro, that sounds like you riding black dick. <laughs> What's up, UPS guy? Thanks for coming. Appreciate you getting dressed up here, dude. Wow, bro, you dress like Flint water. <laughs> oh. Dude, no, but thank you for coming. Thank you. What's up, dude? How you doing? Do you know who I am? Your kid, oh, that's your dad right there? This is the whole family? And that's your daughter, and that's son, and that's another son. That's what, you're the, that's the UPS, yeah, you got him. I hear you, bro, welcome. Dude, you committed to that outfit, bro. God, dude, that's amazing. But that's what's up, welcome. How old is your daughter, miss? I'm not trying no shit, I just wanna let you know. I wouldn't disrespect you like that. You're 21? Okay. I might. Nah. I... <laughs> I had to make sure everything was good. Okay? Coast is clear. That's an old bitch in Utah. 21, bro? Come on, Pops. She should be a great grandmother by now. What's going on? 20-year-old, one-year-old single woman in Utah? Damn, you accompany her everywhere. That's how you do it, bro. You just follow her. I'm like this. What do you do, Dad? I'm curious about you. You look like homeless Robert De Niro. <laughs> Can you spend some change? Fuck you then, eh? <laughs> no, what do you do, man? <laughs> Nothing, at <the> moment. <laughs> Nothing at the moment? Really, you, you... I take care of my mom, she's in her 80s. She's in her 80s? That's a sweet way to say you're unemployed, though. That's a nice... <laughs> no, that's, that's adorable, because we almost thought that he was not unemployed for a second. <laughs> let me let you know, you're supposed to take care of your mom, motherfucker, that's how it works. I need to kick it with some Mormons, man. You guys aren't Mormon, what do you guys do? Manage a GameStop? <laughs> Bro, y'all are two rejections away from shooting up this entire club, dog. Let me, let me tell you something, bro. Bobby D, if you see him reach for anything, tackle that motherfucker. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.
Now, you guys weren't religious at all? Your dad is, but you didn't want... You found the area. You were whacking off at like 12. You were like, I can't go back. <laughs> Joseph Smith didn't have this shit right here. <laughs> Yo, if he had porn hub, he would have never left New York. <laughs> he would have been in his basement like, I found Jesus! <laughs> Are you going to vaccinate your kids, miss? Thanks, miss. <laughs> I don't have a gender. <laughs> Neither do koalas. <laughs> you won't vaccinate them? You're not? What do you mean? Wait, hold on. Dude, this is this new shit that I don't get that women do. You don't want kids, right? Okay. But it's like you're young and hot now. So it's like fun doing shit, you know? But like soon you're gonna be 24 and then nobody cares, you know what I mean? Like, and then what are you gonna do from 24 to 94? Like what are you gonna do for all those years when you don't have kids? It's, that's what happens. That's when you start caring about fucking pets. Drugs, nah, you don't wanna do drugs. No, come on, dude. Actually, old people should do meth. It's like their teeth are already gone. You know, it's like, there's really no cost at that age. And you could use a little pep in your step, at the, you know. I'm down with old people meth. I'm 100% down. Old people meth, great idea. Young people meth, useless. You got the energy, fucking figure it out. But so you really don't want kids at all. Is that your boyfriend right there? Your brother? Oh, okay. Sorry, mate. <laughs> Anything goes back home, bro. I don't know how it is out here. <laughs> they say the brother's the perfect fit. No, I'm just <laughs> Guys, it's like Lego. Anyway. <laughs> mm. So no kids, man. That's so weird. Do you really, how old are you? 38. Oh, you ain't having no fucking kids, right? <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> That's some shit that just happened and you trying to get out in front of it. Like, uh, yeah. oh, I don't want any kids. Well, I, it's so stupid. I would never want kids. It's like when a guy's going bald and just shaves it. <laughs> this is my choice. This is how I wanted my hair to look like. Thirty-eight, man. Ovaries might be kicking. Are you on birth control? You are. Even at thirty-eight. <laughs> Sweetheart, I think you could pull the goalie. You know, <laughs> this fucking game is over. Thirty-eight? You worried about getting knocked up randomly? Dude, at thirty-eight, you gotta fuck a girl down with gravity just to get her pregnant, like. Ever sit in a handstand for 48 hours? Is it there? Is it connected? <laughs> oh, I hope this doesn't jinx me and then I don't have to have kids. That'd be <laughs> fucked up. I want some kids. Oh, she's cool, man. Thanks for asking, bro. Hater. Look, I'm out here in fucking Australia trying to get some pussy. Now you make me feel all guilty. I got a 38-year-old who's barren, ready to go. You know what I mean? <laughs> Jesus. Are you not from West Palm Beach? What are, where are you from originally? Uruguay. That's that fucking hair, bro. <laughs> it's amazing, that hair, right? He's a fucking Lego. Look at the guy. Like, he takes that shit off at the end of the night, be honest. <laughs> you need to talk to my man. You need to... Yo, hook him up, bro. He too rich to not have hair. You know you can fix this now, bro. Come on. You want that. You like your bald head. Like fucking Cuban Dr. Phil. That's what he looks like. Your name is Phil? I'm good at this, guys. I'm good at this. I'm good at this. What can I say? You know what I mean? It's... Phil! This young son of a bitch and his fucking hair, right? And now, is this your wife, Phil? This beautiful woman right here? Absolutely. 
You see what she's doing? See how she's teasing you, bro? See how she's teasing you? Because she could grow her hair long, but she's like, I'll just cut it anyway. Fuck that motherfucker. Like, I just, I'm going to just keep my hair a little bit longer than his bald ass, and he can't say shit. <laughs> she got your dream haircut. This motherfucker. <laughs> Phil, she is torturing you. How long have you been married to Phil? Just a year? Oh, wow. How much did the last wife take, Phil? How much did the last... <laughs> you had hair, she took your hair. <laughs> God bless you, man. Uruguay. What is what is so unique about Uruguay? Why are you helping them out, bro? <laughs> Wait, do you know about Uruguay, bro? Oh, for what? Are you Uruguayan? Oh, you getting told what to do right now. Do not mess with her. She's a villain from a Die Hard movie, bro. You... Do not mess with that lady right there. The second she got angry, uh-uh. You shut it down, Phil. Phil, you shut it down. I got a feeling Punta del Este isn't the most fun place. It's wherever the fuck Phil was going for the last two decades. <laughs> One word, two syllables. Hookers, bro. That's the... <laughs> Let's go, Phil. This guy's like Phil in training. Who is this guy next to you? <laughs> One day, dude, you're going to grow up and be divorced just like him, bro. You keep on... <laughs> I bet he could grow his hair. He just cuts that shit anyway. He's like, fuck it, man. Phil looks so fucking cool like that, bro. Is your birthday today, dude? Happy birthday, man. Wish him a happy birthday. <laughs> 50 years old? 50 years old? You look amazing for 50 years old, bro. Are you full white? Because this is incredible aging if you're white. If you've got some Latin or something in you, it doesn't count. What are you? Half Italian, half Spanish. Like from Spain? They're white. This is some good aging. Black people, white people don't age like this, right? These black people right here are 73 and 74 years old. This is, listen. Those black people behind them, they're grandparents. So you don't even... You don't even know how old black people are ever. But that, for a white, that's pretty good aging, is it not? Objective opinion. Wow, dude, what's the trick? Not a lot of trips to Uruguay. <laughs> <laughs> and this is your wife? How long have you guys been married? 28 years, holy shit, man. Kids, how many? Two, you got twins? Wow, boys or girls? Boys, oh, that's what's up. No, that's just, it's so much better to have boys because with girls, there's like, you know, guys have those weird fantasies about like being with them both and shit. And like, like if you're, how old, are your, how old are your sons? 21, so if they like shared a girl, you wouldn't be like, oh, it's gross. You'd be like, fucking let's go, like. <laughs> right? Like. They're twins. You let them share clothes, baseball mitts. Like, what's the next best thing, right? Like, they shared everything their whole life. They're not gonna share a little, you know, conejo. Like, <laughs> they're identical twins or not? Identical twins. That's a glitch. That's not supposed to happen. That means one of his sperm splits into two. You beast, bro. You fucking beast, bro. You know how proud that made him as an Italian, bro? It was too much in one of you. Bro, is his cum thick? Does it like... Does it come out like Gogurt? Just... You gotta like push at the base, like toothpaste. <laughs> you 
You should have known this was. What's up with you guys, though? How do you guys know each other? I knew you guys were military. I fucking knew it, dude. I knew it the second I looked over. Bravo. Thank you. That's what I'm talking about, man. Korean War. You're welcome. No. You better, you owe these motherfuckers a thank you, bro. <laughs> uh, you guys live in Nashville? Nah, you do. You just visiting him? That's what's up, man. Ah, uh, dude. I feel like you look like if Louis C.K. didn't need to jerk off in front of women. 